Alright guys, what up, it is your friendly neighborhood, Spider-Man. No, just kidding, it's AJ or Eclipse. But anyways, today I've decided to come up with a brand new series for the channel. Now, I know a lot of people like watching series on other people's channels, and a lot of people like watching series on YouTube in general, so I thought, why not come up with a series of my own for you guys? So, I'm sure you can tell by the title what this is already going to be about, but basically, if you kind of can't really tell or you need a, more of an explanation it's basically about just the things that piss me off you know i'm going to be talking about the things that you know piss me off you know the things that irritate me the things that bother me in real life or in a video game depending on what i feel like talking about that day but yeah i thought maybe you guys would enjoy this and i think i'll enjoy doing these types of videos because there's a lot of things that irritate me in real life so i guess let's get into it all right so this one is going to be about the wannabe badass the fake badass the kid that thinks he is the most hardcore motherfucker ever to walk the face of the earth but really he's just a complete dumbass so i don't know why people do this i mean it doesn't really make sense to me i mean what what is being a badass accomplished you know what can you do with this you know you're gonna put on your job application hey what skills do you have to work here what, what why do you think we should hire you to work here oh, i'm a badass i mean that doesn't really work anywhere i mean i don't know what that status will bring you in life i don't i don't understand it but yeah I got a story about this too. So there's this kid in my school when I went back in high school, cause I'm in college now. But when I was in high school, I was a junior, he was a senior. And this kid had some kind of mental disability. I don't know what it was. Nothing wrong with having a mental disability. I'm not bashing him for that. But this kid was just like a little bit more weird and like out of the ordinary than other people in the school. And even though he was like this, he still knew that this was like probably a stupid thing to do. And he like still knew what he was doing. But anyways, I think it was the night of the prom for seniors or whatever. And he was sitting in the hallway and he was talking to all these girls in there. And not like he was talking talking to them like they were interested like they were all just kind of smiling and smirking and laughing at him i mean they were the bitches of the school but anyway he was talking to them and he said he said that he was gonna bring the alcohol to the prom and kid is obviously full of shit probably doesn't even have alcohol in his house parents probably lock it up if they do have alcohol in his house but yeah he was just like yeah i'm gonna bring alcohol to prom for you guys i'm gonna sneak it in the fruit punch on the table and everybody's like all right you do that man you do that bring the alcohol to the graduation i want to have some alcohol he's like all right deal and then he smiles and then he walks away probably didn't even go to the prom to be honest with you he was, he was obviously full of shit so one day i ended up talking to this kid and i'm not really one to turn down conversations with anybody you know i'm not really a social person yeah, i don't really like talking to everybody on the face of the earth but if you want to talk to me i'll talk back because i'm a nice person and that's how i am but anyway this kid starts talking to me one day and he's we're like talking about random things i can't even remember what we were talking about but he mentions that he was in a gang i'm like oh you were in a gang it's like yep been in it for a while i'm still in it actually i'm like oh what do you do in this gang and he's like well we sell drugs and we sh sometimes shoot people sometimes we'll steal a few cars i robbed the gas station once he's like telling me all this stuff i'm like oh and i'm just kind of sitting there you know just listening to this and i'm like oh what was your gang called and we were in the lunch line when this happens he said that he was the leader of it so i'm like oh cool what is your gang called and he looks at me and goes the douche nut fuckers and i completely just lost my shit there like i, I just had enough like that was it for me i was just like yep okay i'm walking away and i just like smiled and i just quickly started walking away because i didn't want to like start laughing at the kid and be rude to him because that's like an asshole move but i was just like i couldn't handle it anymore i was just like yep i've had enough that's it time to go but yeah i don't know why people try and so hard to be a badass i mean does a badass really get you anything i mean it doesn't get you a job it doesn't get you in a college i mean as far as real life is concerned i'm pretty sure nobody could give a shit less whether you're a badass or not post it in the comments does it really get you anything does it get you anywhere i'm gonna assume no but anyways that is the video let me know if you enjoyed it let me know what you think of this series and if i should do more of these I'm not gonna do them every day just think that I don't want to beat them down like a dead cat. Like, I'll do one of these, and then I'll do a series of, like, other random videos, and then I'll come back to it every once in a while. But yeah, let me know what you think. Let me know if you know anybody like this. I'm sure everybody has to know someone like this. Whether it be in your school or your workplace or wherever, I'm sure you know somebody who's a wannabe badass. So if you do, post it in the comments below. I'd like to hear it. And anyways, that is the video. This has been AJ or Eclipse or Spider-Man. And I guess I'll catch you guys in the next video. 
See you.